there's one last thing that I want to test to verify that everything works the way it should. And uh, we probably should have tested this in one of the previous videos, but I forgot to do it. And I want to make sure that we test the expiration process because a JWT uh, has an expiration time that we set ourselves. And this just ensures that a user is logged in only for a certain amount of time. Now we set the access token expiration time to be 30 minutes. Uh, and so that means that if a user logs in and he keeps his token for more than 30 minutes, after that 30 minute mark, if he tries to use that token to access any of our endpoints, it should throw an error because it's already expired. So let's test this out. And the easiest way to test this is, first of all, we're not gonna wait 30 minutes, that's ridiculous. So what we're gonna do is, we're gonna set this to one minute. And we're just gonna test this real quick. And so I'm going to log in this user. So this token is valid for exactly one minute. And so we'll go to create posts. Actually, we'll just do get posts. It doesn't really matter. And I'll paste this in here. And you'll see this works. And we're going to just wait for one full minute. And after one minute, let's just verify that we get a unauthorized error because the token has expired. Okay, so it should be about one minute now. And so if we test this, we should now get an error. So after one minute, it says it could not validate credentials. Now we could set up a log message to say that, hey, this token is expired, but um, we don't need to worry too much about that. Uh, as long as it throws an error and it gives them a 401, I think that's good enough for now. And so this confirms that our expiration functionality works. And the last thing to do is, well, let's make sure we change this back. So once again, it doesn't matter what time you choose, it's up to you. I'm just gonna do 30 minutes. Actually, I'm gonna do 60 minutes just for testing purposes. Uh, moving forward, I don't wanna have to continually uh, get a new token after every 30 minutes. So 60 minutes is a good number.